Hi, my name is Ashish and in this video we will see how to create a service connection between Azure Pipelines and Azure subscription. So let me just quickly log on to my Azure DevOps portal and take it from there. Alright, this is my Azure DevOps portal and if I go to my project settings, this is my project. Then the one that I would be working on. And I would go to my project settings and here when you scroll down you see this service connections click on it and there is an already, already a service connection made between this uh, project and my github account because I was the uh, I cloned the uh, repo from the Microsoft uh, repository and cloned it to my github account then I would have to authorize my Azure DevOps to have access on this github repo so I have to authorize it it created the service connection but uh, you would click on uh, a new service connection from the service connection window and you are making a service connection for Azure resource manager click on Azure resource manager click on next we are doing service principle which is uh, automatic and recommended click on next it would load your subscription uh, I would select my PSU core subscription here I'm gonna select my uh, resource group in which I will deploy the the environment when this pipeline runs so let me just it here all right I click on next password perfect I will log in and it should pull up it should uh, show me the list of the resource groups in this uh, drop down section let me just pause it and come back so what I'll do is I'll fill in the name I I keep this as blank to have it fetch all the resource group description is optional grant access permissions to all pipelines I click on save it is setting up the connection let's see how it goes so now what it what it is doing it it is testing the connection with my Azure subscription and you know if it will not be able to connect or to communicate or whatever it is trying to do at the back and it would fail and my connection would not be established then I would have to do it again and if I will not be able to establish the service connection then I would not be able to run the pipelines and deploy the resources but here you see that uh, this connection has been made and if I click on it you would see it is the Azure resource manager it is using the service principle authentication and uh, you can manage the service principle you can click on it it'll take you to the Azure portal so it is the registered app that gets uh, registered under the Azure Active Directory so as of me this is nothing so this is the uh, the app name that get registered under your uh, is your ad and uh, this is the home page this is the by default uh, setting that you have got so if i show you how did it uh, go there you will see i mean Okay, it is on the portal so let me just go to the Azure AD and under here you click on uh, uh, app registrations
on applications here it is you click on it so that is this is the app that that got created when i created the service connection so uh, that's a different how the app registration works and uh, how it gets created using the service principal name this is the client id that is altogether a different concept but you got the idea and uh, if i you know if i want to regenerate the certificates and uh, the keys i can you cannot see it here but you have to, you can create the new client secret key I'll I'll make a separate video uh, under Azure AD or under Azure AD B two C two. You know, give more information about this topic. But you got the idea how this uh, service connection was uh, made, and uh, you know how it finally I'm able to uh, create a service connection, and I can run the pipelines and specify the name under my. Uh, you see this. Uh, as your pipelines i've made this project and this is uh, this is not the deployment this is the uh, the build pipeline which would uh, actually run my pipeline on the build agent that gets created so i'll let i'll give you more information in the coming videos but this is how i am going to do it so this is my pipeline and uh, service connection is made i'll see you guys in the next video thank you have a good day bye bye